The Salvation Army works year-round, providing more than 450,000 meals, the safety net of the residential programs, and spiritual care for the lost and hurting. It all begins with a drop in the bucket. For Sheila, that drop in the bucket is your monetary donation to the Family Residential Program, which will serve as a step up for Sheila to obtain self-sufficiency and financial independence. It all started because I had lost my job and I was living in my complex. I spent two years there and it came to a point that I couldn't afford the place anymore. And after that, I spent a night in my car, which was um, not a good experience because me, my kids, we had mosquitoes biting us. And after that situation, I thought about the Salvation Army. After spending the night in the car, the next morning when I was getting chancy ready for school, uh, a lot of thoughts run through my mind. But Salvation Army was the last, was the last resort. But after researching, I realized that um, coming to Salvation Army would be the, the best way to go for, for the kids. During my first night at the Salvation Army, we, me and the kids, we, we did feel safe. It was a big difference from when we was in my car, because we had a roof over our heads. One of my best time of being at the Salvation Army is my life school classes with um, one of my teachers, um, Jeremy. He sits down and makes me about resumes and a lot of important stuff like budgeting, which I need a lot of help with that. Another benefit um, for being at the Salvation Army is um, my daughter, Leah. She's been able to go to daycare. And while she's there, I'm able to look for, I was able to look for work. My main focus was my kids, and the next step was finding a job, and then now a place, which I won't take for granted anymore. Yeah, I learned from being here, just don't take things for granted. One of the best um, things that I love about the Salvation Army is um, Soul Sisters, where us single women, we spend an hour every Tuesday, we talk about the Lord, and Mostly talk about what is going on in our lives since we've been here and what we've been going through. When I came to Savage Army, I felt mostly hopeless because when you have two kids that's depending on you and you have nowhere to go, that's very heartbreaking. I came to Salvation Army so I can give Chauncey and Leah a better life. This is my final chapter at the Salvation Army. My family and I have been blessed since we've been here. This has been an amazing, long journey. It has been well worth it because we are going to have our new home soon. This is what your support of the Salvation Army means to me. The Salvation Army helped us rebuild our lives and now we have hope for our future. So please help the Salvation Army help us.